Now to the Bradley Manning trial, where Thursday a military judge rejected defense motions to dismiss a key charge of aiding the enemy in the court martial of Bradley Manning, the Army private who turned over hundreds of thousands of classified documents to anti secrecy group WikiLeaks. The trial continued today with more rebuttal witnesses from the government, government prosecution. RT's Liz Walls in Fort Meade, Maryland, with the latest. Well, today we heard testimony aimed at giving the court an idea of Bradley Manning's character when he was serving in the Army at the time that he leaked the classified information. The prosecution called Jurlee Showman to the stand. She was Manning's team leader on base and was responsible for counseling Manning. Now, her testimony was controversial. She said Manning's behavior was questionable, and based on her conversations with the Army private, she believed Manning had no loyalty. To the United States. She said she once pointed to the flag and asked Manning what it meant to him. He said the flag meant nothing to him, according to this witness. The witness went as far as saying she had suspicions that Manning was a spy. During cross examination, Manning's attorney, David Coombs, attacked this witness's credibility. He asked her why she never would put such a serious allegation in writing if she was concerned about this. He kept drilling her on this, asking if she really thought uh, he was a risk. Why she never put it in writing, knowing Manning was an intelligence analyst and that uh, he worked with classified information on a daily basis. Also called to the stand was Showman's supervisor, Mr. Atkins. Showman said she reported, Showman said that she reported these concerns to Atkins, but when asked about this, he said he didn't recall these concerns. He, he also said that he suffers from memory loss. Coombs pointed to the fact that uh, Manning. Uh, had filed a complaint against this witness. It was an equal opportunity complaint for using derogatory terms toward Manning, specifically calling him, quote, faggoty. Now, all of this gets back to trying to prove Manning's intent when he leaked troves of documents to WikiLeaks. The defense says he did it to expose wrongdoing, but the prosecution is alleging that Manning aided the enemy when he leaked hundreds of thousands of classified documents because uh, they believe in the prosecution's prosecution's view, they believe he knew the information would be on the internet and as a result be seen by the enemy. Also discussed today are the charges of theft of government property that Manning faces. The defense is trying to get these charges dismissed. The government is saying that Manning stole, stole government information, but they've been struggling to prove that there's a monetary value behind these documents uh, Manning obtained. And if so, what the value is. Uh, we're still waiting to hear the judge's ruling on this. It's unclear when that is going to happen. It is expected that we are going to hear more testimony from more witnesses in this rebuttal phase of the trial before we hear a verdict from the judge possibly next week. In Fort Meade, Maryland, Liz Wall, RT.